Hey guys, today I'm done with the car again and tonight I'm going to give you the tip of this year if you have problems with your gauges inside the car. Um, I got a tip on this tip on the internet on a Jeep forum and it related to uh, the malfunctioning of my fuel gauge, my oil pressure gauge and my temperature sender unit. And somebody told me that I should actually check the ground of my engine and the specific ground called 301, 301 and I will show you where it's sitting. We're going down on the passenger side in the engine. So you can see my distributor over here and if we move in you see this one that's the 301 that one was sitting firmly but when I took off the nut then I could see that it was a lot of corrosion um, on, on the on the metal uh, of the wire holders there underneath here so I want to show you what happened when I clean it off I took some sandpaper some electronic cleaner spray I think that's isopropanol and I just cleaned it up and I put it back and this is the result we're going into the car so here you see all the gauges I just replaced all the bulbs the LED lights and I'm going to turn on the key and guess what all of them reads perfect well obviously this one is not the engine is not on now but this one I, test, I tested when I drove it a couple of days ago the fuel gauge perfect watch is working the pressure gauge which was never working it was always standing on the maximum as soon as, as, soon as I switched the ignition and the battery and in fact the previous owner he even replaced the oil pressure reader unit to this one down here completely in vain just because of a metal ground a poorly properly poorly working ground unit 301 well that's all for tonight thanks for listening bye